Hello everyone. In today's video, we will study about the structure of a dicot rod. This is the transfer section of a dicot rod. Outermost layer of the rod is known as epiblema or the piliferous layer. Outermost layer of rod is called epiblema. It is made up of single layer of parenchymatous cells which are compactly arranged without intercellular spaces. It possesses root hairs which are single cell the function of piliferous layer is protection below this cortex is present cortex is simple multi layered and consist of thin walled parenchymatous cells with intercellular spaces to make the gaseous exchange easier next layer is endodermis it is made up of single layer of barrel shaped parenchymatous cells the cells of endodermis possesses cisparian thickening in their radial and tangential wall cisparian thickening is the deposition of wall material so brain and lignin but the, these cisparian strips are absent in endodermal cells which are located opposite to the protoxylem elements these cells are called passage cells so which water and mineral salts are conducted next layer is pericycle pericycle is generally single layer of parenchymatous cells lateral root originates from the pericycle next is vascular system vascular bundles are radial xylem and phloem strands are arranged on alternate radii which are separated by parenchymatous tissues known as conjunctive tissue the xylem is xr protoxylem faces toward periphery and the metaxylem towards the center number of xylem strands is 4 therefore xylem is tetrarch next is pith pith is usually absent in dicot roots